some exciting and welcoming news on the COVID-19 vaccine front. Johnson & Johnson says its vaccine has proven to be safe and effective. Health reporter and registered nurse Allie Gorman here in studio with details on this, and it is exciting, Allie. This is exciting. This is good news, guys. Within weeks, we could have a third COVID-19 vaccine authorized here in the U.S., the benefits of this one, it's just one dose and it's easier to ship and store than the other vaccines. Johnson & Johnson releasing new clinical trial results showing their one dose vaccine is 85% effective at preventing severe disease due to COVID-19. In the U.S., it was found to be 72% effective at preventing infection with symptoms in the first place. Um, the headline really does not do this justice. Dr. Nina Gentile led the clinical trial at Temple Health. She says while the data still needs to be vetted, it is promising. It shows good safety with few side effects. Comparing it to the 94-95% efficacy reported with Pfizer and Moderna vaccines is like comparing apples to oranges. They were tested at different times and in different locations. Johnson & Johnson's vaccine was tested at the height of the pandemic in the U.S., also in Latin America and South Africa, where concerning new variants of the virus are spreading. So to have data um, that includes um, people who were um, infected by those variants and see that, the, uh, that it was protective against it, I think it's really, really remarkable. I think it's, it's actually an opportunity here. The company will now submit data to the FDA. It hopes to get emergency use authorization by the end of February and supply 100 million doses to the U.S. by June. And that will bring a much needed boost in supply. Now, if you want to hear more about how Dr. Gentile says Philadelphia played a role in testing this vaccine, it's streaming now on the 6ABC family of apps like Roku and Apple TV. Sorry.